So I am in close to Fort Lauderdale with a good friend of Remus for many, many years. Rhoda, tell me how long and how did you meet Rima and how long have you known her? Uh, I've known Rima for about 66 years. Wow. And she was a neighbor. We had all moved into new houses. It was a development of new houses. And I looked out the back and she was uh, like two houses behind me on an angle. And I see this pregnant woman and her uh, Shelly was crawling on the ground and she was very pregnant with Gary. Oh, wow. <laughs> and I said, oh my goodness. And I just had the one uh, who was um, six months old when I moved there. And anyhow, we finally met as neighbors and we hit it off immediately. And I was very impressed with her because she's so outgoing and I tend to be on the shy, quiet side. Aww. So we worked out very well together. And I thought she was a kid because she was only like 22 when I met her and I was 27. Oh, and wow. I thought, oh my God, she's a baby and she has two children. <laughs> but uh, we used to walk to the store together and take our carriage seats and, you know, push the carriages and and then um, we just got very close over the years and uh, everything was good. And I went through her whole marriage with her and her whole divorce with her. Wow, and, and it's amazing when yeah, you have when she so met like When one. she met Tony, they wanted to see each other. I babysat for Debbie, who was little at the time. Okay. So she could see him and uh, it worked out very well. So tell us, Joan, a little bit about maybe like one of the things that you remember the most and that you admire about Rima. Uh, mostly, I'm very impressed with how active she was. Even then, as a new mother with babies and everything, she still ran to dancing and went to Atlantic City and was far away. And I was very impressed because I did everything. I pretty well stayed put and didn't do that much. So to me, she was always quite intriguing. Aw, lots of fun, huh? Yeah, lots She of had fun. a great sense of humor. My husband loved her. He had a good time with her. And then uh, I've, he's been gone for 25 years, but I met a man in this building and she got a big kick out of him and he, he got a kick out of her. They were always kidding around, Aww. so he liked her very much. Oh, that's great. <laughs> yeah. That's beautiful. It is. So maybe share with us something that you can remember that was super funny that she did or that super. you guys did together even. I'm trying to think super funny. It's so hard to remember, but... All I know is we have a lot of fun together, and um, she got me started with a lot of stuff. And at one part, at one point, she went to a weight place to lose weight, and I used to be heavy. <laughs> and she was just after Shelley was not Shelley after Gary was born and Debbie, she was left with some weight, so she went and she told me to go. So I went there, and that worked out very well. So. Oh, that's fun. <laughs> awesome. Well, Rhoda, thank you so much for just taking time oh, to, to be with pleasure. me and talk with me really? about Rima. She was very special to a lot of people. Very special person. She had many friends, and she was well-liked. In fact, here in Century Village, she'd come down every, every month or every other month and uh, she used to do my gym classes with me and my dancing. We'd... She used to tell me that. And let me ask you, she would drive down here, right? At the beginning, she drove down, and then Shelly said she didn't want her driving anymore. So... Right, so she took her away. Yeah, but yeah. she she uh, she was the For driver. years she drove, but, right? And I wasn't. I, I, began, I learned late. I didn't even want to. I hated it. I hate technology. <laughs> Yeah. And my husband taught me, and I'm crying. I don't like it. And he says, you have to. It's important. Uh -huh. Now I 
drive, but I still don't go on highways, but I drive all over and I look That's up at the really sky nice. and I say, thank you, George, for insisting Aww, I drive. And sweet. Rima gets a bit, got a big kick out of the fact that my friends here, the older ones, none of them drive. Either they can't or they never did. Right. So I'm the designated driver and she gets such a kick out of that. I love it. <laughs> That's great. Well, thank you so much. And um, I'm happy that you could be with us uh, for her memorial. Well, thank you, Rhoda. I wish I could be there in person. Thank you. It's okay. Grandma's kitchen before the battery I dies. I'm going over her schoolwork. Oh, show, show your mother your new glasses. See my nice. new glasses? Yeah, but why can't you wait until I'm together and fixed up and looking better? Honestly. Well, she knows what you look like. Yeah, I know. You're playing she... with your new dishwasher, huh? Yeah, I know that she knows what I look like, but I could look a little better, you know. You always like to get me when I look like this. Well, right? last time I got you, you were stuffing your face. Yeah, that's what I mean. Either with something Say goodbye. sticking out. Bye bye. Say hello, Nana. Hi, Nana. This is Rover. See, I know you can't see his eyes here. I'll show you. Right here. Hi, Angel, why don't you turn the light in here? Grandma. Well, your daughter. Say hello to your mother. <laughs> Hi, Mom. I just got back from school. Did you make a tape of the bathroom, too? Yeah, I just got done with that in the stairway. Oh. The battery keeps dying out. Oh, well, that's good. And you can... How nice you look today. Oh, well, I always dress up for school, but now I can get comfortable. Did you show um, Grandma the downstairs, too? Oh, I missed it downstairs. I forgot oh, about that. We'll have to do that next. Okay. I was going to show her the leech field we're di digging for the septic. Oh, that should be fun. <laughs> Did you show her Big Alice or whoever was up here? Scoop. Scoop. No, you? not yet. And what about the fire engine? That's very necessary. It's got a quick shot. I'll go down and take another look. Oh, but I think it's very important to get the, uh, the office downstairs that you do. Okay. Okay, hey, now I'm going to go upstairs. Okay, goodbye. Did, did you show Turn it back on. Here comes Simon. Oh. Where is Angel? She's going for a ride with Shelly. Somebody backed into the back of... Are you ready to move to a whole new place that's amazing? I'm ready to move to a whole new amazing place. <clears throat> and I'm going to move to my myself. And it's going to be fabulous. Yes!